Hey, hey, people. Jacob here at Sutherland Chevrolet in Nicholasville, Kentucky. And I'm here today to show you our 2013 Camry. I'm going to show you the good, the bad, the ugly. I'm going to start on the outside here and go to the inside. Um, the wheels all have kind of like a little bit of scuffing around the edge. I'll try to get my big shadow out of the way to show you that. But it's very minor. I mean, it might not even pick it up too well on the camera. Um, but they all kind of have it a little bit. Again, the way these wheels are made, um, it doesn't show it as bad as some of the other wheels do, but you've just got some kind of light scuffing. Um, probably should for a 100,000 mile vehicle. That's it over here as well too. The very minor as far as that goes um, on the body you've got kind of scratches all over the place you're missing some clear coat up here on the roof and hopefully that's showing up in the camera a little bit better than it looks like it's showing up in the camera for me what's this up here something's kind of rubbed it there maybe a bush or something i don't know if that'll come off up here you've got all kinds of little scratches and things. All kinds of little scratches on the front bumper. Some of this is bugged out, some of it's scratches. You can see someone's trying to touch up some stuff here. They've rubbed that bumper you know, up against something there. It's got some scratches there. You'll see over on the passenger side. It's been roughed up here too. So it's been a good family vehicle, you know. Now, I don't know exactly what it is. It looks like a lot of it may come off, may not. But you've got all this like black paint, and I don't know if it's picking that up from the road, but as you can see, if I pick at it, it's coming off on my fingernail. So that leads me to believe that some of that may come off, but it's kind of peppered this whole side of the vehicle a little bit. You see, you've got some scratches here, scratches there, scratches there. So it's kind of covering all the scratches, but you'll see that black like paint kind of all over this side so I don't know where it's picked it up from but you got what is this here is that going to come off maybe maybe not you got a bunch of scratching behind the door handles here so I don't know what's caused all that fingernails keys you got scratches from probably the key or something here or a ring so again that black paint kind of goes all the way back here it wraps around the bumper a little bit don't know what it's from may come off may not get some missing clear coat here on the back of the uh, trunk lid and I can't tell you got a, several little scratches and things here I can't tell if the clear coat it almost seems like the clear coats getting thin here but it may just need a really good bath scratches here something's rubbed up against it little scratches kind of all over this corners rubbed up against something pretty good so again it's been a good family vehicle this should come all off this dirt right here don't really know what it's from but I rubbed it with my fingernail earlier and a lot of that was coming off with my fingernail you've got uh, some more clear coat missing up here on the roof it's pretty normal for these uh, early teen Camrys like this um, scratches here, scratches there, scratches there. You know, Toyota's not necessarily known for making the perfect exterior vehicle, but what they're known for is their reliability. And uh, you should still be getting that here. So, scratches here in the door handle, you know, someone nails or keys or what have you. Something's rubbed this mirror a little bit on the outside. Probably hard to see the way I've got it angled in the sun. And, you know, scratches. You got little scratches there. Pretty nice little scratch right there. This side doesn't seem to have all that black paint the other side has. But it's got all kinds of little scratches and things, you know. Little tiny things. Hopefully not a big deal to you. Maybe it is. I'm trying to see if there's anything I'm kind of missing here on the outside, but... I think I pretty much got it all covered. There were some scratches here maybe I didn't get to show you too well. Just due to the black paint, probably wasn't really noticing it. 
but uh, scratches here, scratches there. So it's been well used, you know? It's got a lot of character. I'm gonna try and open up. Is that open? Nope. Let's try again. Hmm. Maybe I'm doing something wrong. That did not want to open up. There we go. I just need to give it some uh, some elbow grease. See, and close that back. Let's try again. There we go. Heard it release that time and it came right open. So maybe it was just, I don't know, sealed up really well. But as you can see, it needs a nice, good detailing. Um, we haven't cleaned it or anything yet. And I'll go to the interior here. I'm going to go to a wider angle so I can show it to you a little better. I might sneeze here. Let's see. <laughs> Bless me. Sorry. <laughs> But, uh, you know, we've got some sanding in a seat here. Maybe it's a little roughed up right there. See that? Um, you've got uh, some staining in that passenger seat there, too. But it needs a really good detailing. There's your rear. Doesn't look as stained in the seats, but definitely needs some really good vacuuming. I'm going to get inside here. Show you that passenger floor a little bit better, but it should clean up pretty well. Uh, here you'll notice, and I'm going to go to the regular um, lens here um, and show you this mirror. So it may pick up in the mirror. It might not. Let's maybe go to a mirror that's a little bit, I mean, a lens that's maybe a little bit more zoomed in. You've got kind of this weird effect going around the outside of the mirror. See, you can probably see it the way I've got it focused now in this corner right there. And I don't know what causes that. I had a 2006 Corolla that did the same thing. And uh, I don't. there wasn't a way that I could figure out to fix it. You can see it kind of here. It almost looks like it's dirty. But that's actually like the mirror. It's either the mirror or behind the mirror or something in front of the mirror. But I don't know how to get it off. I could never figure it out. And so I just drove that way and everything was fine. But I'm just like, you know, cosmetically, it's got this kind of weird effect going on with the mirror. Um, so I would use water to clean the mirror or something like Windex is probably fine. Um, and uh, it should be good to go from there. You can see that the steering wheel is well worn, you know. Sorry, let me zoom out a little bit there. <laughs> that's probably a little bit easier to see it so um, you can see that it's well worn in but it's leather wrapped steering wheel some of the uh, dye the paint is coming out of it um, so but it feels nice and the vehicle drives out really well you can see here there's some interior scuffing and things scratches and some of this is just dirt it needs to be cleaned up but a lot of it is actual scratching from things so but it's been a good vehicle for somebody and it should continue to be um, as the mileage on it for a Toyota is still very low. So, but again, this is Jacob at Sutherland Chevrolet in Nicholasville, Kentucky. This is our 2013 Camry. I just wanted to show it to you. Um, thank you and have a wonderful day.